Alrighty, we are here to react to another Burning D&D &D episode, this one called Battle for Optimar. Alright, and I'm going to get started with it in 3, 2, 1. Pretty sure this is going to be uh, an episode that's entirely inside of an encounter, so, yeah. Okay, so, now, Amarda has to make a DC 27 fortitude save. Oh, boy. Oh, come on, girl! Amarda, yeah. Amarda. So that is, uh, uh, yeah, that is exactly 27. Okay. Yes! yes! All right. Yes! Good, move. Good job. So, yes, she takes the hits as best she can, but, you know, yeah, she she is significantly weakened now that she's no longer a deity. Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. Okay, so that's... All right. Yeah, closer. giving up god powers will nerf you good. Uh, oh boy. Oh wow, he, he's got he's he's gonna strike at the, he's gonna strike at the dwarf army using his elongated limbs. Ooh. I figure that's how he was had such big movement speed. Boing. Boing, 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 boing. Cruel for arms DLC. Yeah. Yeah. Holy! On the bright oh. side, his damage was really bad. You know, I should have just yeah. waited for a Min Min um, uh, amiibo to come out before right. making Cruel my King K. Rule amiibo. So, with that, and yes, you also notice that the, that the chains around his arms now have barbs on them. Oh, yuck. Oh. Oh, boy. You're not allowed to hang out with Dogie before you plan a song. <laughs> um, that doesn't have anything to do with that. That's a very uh, good uh, combat uh, tactic. Uh, that joke. Sorry. All right, brain. So. All right, so that is a... Big math, big math. Fast mm -hmm. math, fast math. All right. Math. Right. Uh, Seventy-two. You're going to be you're going to be attacking Venom members or the zombie army, uh, or, or are you going to try and hit both? I, I'm going to first turn to Amarta and ask, how do you feel about transform about metamorphosis, and then okay and click you piece of poop. I'm going to use my um, spell-like ability for okay. time stop. All right, three rounds. Okay. First things first. I want to cast... Um, uh, come on, Mouse, what are you doing to me? Celestial Aspect Arm Blade of the Sword Archon on Amarta. Give her a holy long sword. Gesundheit. Oh, Holy long. <sighs> Sorry. Are we done? Sorry. I want to give her a holy long sword for an arm. All right. That'll help be helpful against zombies. All right. And I need a spellcraft for that. All right. Boing. That should be enough. All right. Yep. I'm yep, pretty sure and... that's a pass. <laughs> Here comes uh, yeah. Oof. Here comes the sacrifices. Oh yeah. oh it's a D three, okay. <laughs> okay, the two's not that bad. Okay, so Which uh which trait does that sacrifice? Strength again? Uh huh. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so uh, that's which... half of one turn. Okay, so yes, you're you did celestial aspect and what, what you're doing cry of Ysgard? Um 
aspect has the same sacrifice. Oh, okay. okay. I'm playing it as fair as I can. Okay. But now that you mention it... Uh... <laughs> Playing these guard. And right. I'm not going to cast any other grimoire spells because that's big right. oof I'm feeling right now. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yeah. Okay, so. Now that is how many again? 2d4 barriers. 2d4. Why did I close the dice thing? <laughs> mm. I'm not you. <laughs> All right, five. Ooh. Ooh, that's not bad. Ooh. All right, and they're all going to attack the zombie dwarves. One right. The time stop or off. So that's one round. I still have two more. Whee! All right. <laughs> have Jeez. fun. All right. all right, make them count. Make them count and have fun. You got this. Uh, all right. Um. <clears throat> I'm. Oop, didn't mean to breathe into my mic. Sorry. You're good. I'm thinking. What does Charm Monster do? Uh, Charm Monster is kind of what it says on the tin. Does it work on undead? It functions like Charm Person, except you can. Okay. So, it. Charm makes a humanoid creature regard you as its trusted friend and ally. Um, dead trait. Okay. Okay, uh, undead creatures have immunity to all mind affecting effects. Okay. Darn Mostly because I don't have a mind. I just wanted to ask because it's here in my options and I wanted to see. To be fair, though, Breakin seems to be pretty, you know, in control of his thoughts. Yeah, true. I was thinking more like the run of the mill zombies. Uh, oh, I was, I was, <laughs> I was thinking of Breakin specifically, but that's up to Ellie. So, if they're immune to um, mind alter, mind affecting effects, that leaves dominate dominate monster out as well. Ah. Oof. Old monster t would take up a level nine, and I don't want to throw those away that easily. Mm -hmm. uh, <sighs> Dagnabbit! Why do I have so many options? Um, <laughs> okay. Um, summon. I'll, I'll start with some summons then. Okay. The, if what if if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Yeah. In the meantime, you've been doing a really good job with this mass combat stuff, Josh. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome. All right. Well, it's my turn, okay. I have an idea, um, but I'll have to wait to see. I have like 15 ideas. I'm so excited. Same. I have, I'm focusing on one problem at a time. I'm going to punch it. Actually, not falling on her face, I think. Ivan's um, mighty punch. Okay. Uh. I I have I, I have a thing. I, I have a thing. This is a level okay. I'm going to summon a celestial elephant like over here for to to do like strike Alright. Oh uh, like bowling bowling with, bowling with elephants, essentially. Which, which which section are you gonna do it on? Uh like are you gonna attack this army right back here, or are you going to uh, try and take out this, the front section? Uh, I think this... I'm going to have have the elephant charge forward. The more we can prevent reaching us at once, the better. Yeah. Perfect. That goes perfectly inclined with what I had in mind, too. Psychic tandem war elephant. <laughs> ah! Okay. That okay, hurt. Hey, shall we? Okay, I wasn't trying to. Okay, this is two time two round two part one. Uh huh. Um, and since Amarda's right there as well. Oh, um, how about I click on my? Th Actually, 
Yeah. Hold on. Heroism. Yeah. Yes. There we go. All right. And then that's that's two rounds. Mm -hmm. Okay. So heroism. Where did I put my pencil? There. Okay. His office is a mess, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so touch on a creature. Yeah, I can relate. To? My name's Pretty. Okay. And also, I ain't about to leave my girl hanging, so. Twice? Double heroism? On Jaminia. Ah. Okay. Okay. And. Ooh. Okay, so that's. Okay, okay. And in that same vein. <laughs> Who are you giving that to? Same person. Major. All right, Jaminia. Is that all of them? Yeah, that's all three rounds. All right. We. Okay. So uh, time. <laughs> question, Josh. What? Since I did the um, time stop right away at the start of my round, does that mean I only cast one spell on my round and technically still have another? No. No. <laughs> <laughs> I tried. <laughs> I tried. All right. All right. Now I need to multiply that damage by five. Okay. Uh, so that's 27. Okay, awesome. That's a lot. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh, now right. well, I just and then remember for the celestial elephant. Let's see how it does. Kick some booty. Charge. <laughs> Go, Dumbo. Okay, so must make a DC 25 reflex save or take. 22 okay, damage. so that means that, yeah, and I got to check these zombie dwarfs. Okay, reflex. See, see, call me crazy. I don't really think that zombies should have really good reflexes. I'm just saying. Uh, nope, they, uh, nope, they got a 24. Oh, that to Valve. Okay. Alright, that to Valve. Uh, <laughs> okay. So, uh... So, Celestial Elephant charging through. That is about 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, 8 <laughs> times. You know what this all reminds me of? Yeah. That scene in Justice League Unlimited where they're headed up to fight, uh, Justice League, I mean, where they're headed up to um, fight the Thanagarians, and Wonder Woman's like, pretty bad odds. Yeah. They ain't got a chance. All right. <laughs> Is, if that's everything, then it's now Zalen's turn. Oh, oh no. Gosh. Oh, boy. He's the, only <laughs> one, he's the only one we haven't seen in battle yet. This is interesting. I was uh, actually going to say, if you ran over one more row of two zombies, you actually would have got you. <laughs> Alright. You see Z Zaylin pull out Kintel, his that's wonderful his last name. Okay. looking weapon. And then he fires. Oh, jeez. It shoots out this magic missile-like spell that strikes ten dwarves and six party members. Oh, ew! Uh, that's, that's, that, that, that's total 53 or 53 each? 53 each. Oof. What the flop? This is me. I'm, I'm half dead already. Um, All right, but but here's the thing. With the, because of because of mass combat, you have a health pool. Okay. Oh. Okay. So yeah. yes, it's gonna hurt, but okay. So that means that okay. Five, three, six, two, minus. Mm. Mm. So you're, okay, so you're adjusting Shouldn't make that our own individual health mm. for this. Mm. Because, it's, because, it's, because of mass combat. Huh. No, I think it's the pool. Like, it's 530 for the dwarves and, like... Um, the 2500 plus for us. 
Yeah. yeah. But, uh, when yeah, you start listing off numbers, this this this, this guy this immediately, immediately got in my head. Right? I'm sorry, but I gotta do it. Eight six seven five three zero nine eight six seven five three zero nine. All right. I'm trash. I'm guessing that their attacks are a little stronger to target the zombies' pool. Yes, I'm doing a lot of their. I, I, I looked at these really good mass combat rules, and yes, they're really, really good, and I, I know what I'm doing. Okay. okay. So, all right. Just trust, the trust, trust the DM. Trust in me. No, I was oh. hoping you would not go there. Now okay. I hate you. Oh, boy, I love Tarzan. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Right. Well, it does come from another jungle book. <laughs> all right. I'm here. And then you see Zaylin move up to the elephant, and then he just shut. And then, as it's charging at him, he he shoves his hand in front of it, and you see him cast a spell that mm-hmm. none of you have seen before. Knowledge uh, Arcana. Yeah, Knowledge Arcana and Owen Knowledge Religion. Owen Knowledge Religion. Okay. Mm-hmm. So we're gonna have a bonus to this. All right then. Now, I had two ideas about what I could do. I've definitely knocked out one of them now, thanks to seeing what Zaylin uh, can do. So yeah, you both you both realize what he's doing. He's casting the equivalent of mass heal, but with negative energy. Oof. Oh, that's power. draining health. So that's how he's going to keep this army healthy. Yep. Right! He needs to die! Except I'm too scared to do it alone. And so, yeah, the elephant uh, phases out of existence because... Yeah. No. You did an alley! Stop, Stop me. Yes, and Stop yeah, I, you, you see that a, t- a couple of the dwarves have fallen, uh, have fallen, unco- have fallen unconscious because of the attacks. Oh boy. Jalarum, your turn. Um, he goes over to King Arkham. Uh, what happens after they fall? What happens if these guys fall over the edge? Hey, you see him give you a death glare. I prefer not to think about it. Uh, they are ex members of his people, remember that. No, right. he said, it's, don't remind me of how my son died. Oh, jeez. Okay. Okay, uh, give me a sec. All right, well, in that... All right, in the meantime... Uh, I'm going to... Uh, I guess it's... Uh, That's how uh, Owen caused his son to die. Here, I guess. Got um, it. So they can't really sneak attack, it'll just be a pull attack. From here, from... And, of course, because... All right. Let's see, yeah, let's see what I can do with this one. Alrighty. No. Fire attack. No. Special attack bonus. No. Power basic attack bonus. No. Let's see how much lightning does. Alright. Okay, and again, we gotta remember, crits don't do jack. So let's see what happens. Any shenanigan calling you want to do? Alright, there we go. So, okay, nice. As well as multiplying that by, okay. What are you attacking? Uh, these guys here. Okay. Okay. Basically, just trying to push them back. Okay. Okay. That is a. All right. All right, you gonna do anything else? Um, well, that was a full attack, so that was pretty much. Uh, but I can't really move anywhere. Can't do two. Yeah, full you can have two standard actions. Oh, okay. Um. Oh, I, I, I can I do another. So I can do another full yeah. attack. Okay. Yeah. All right. Same thing. Not yes, sure indeed, you may. All right. <laughs> uh, there we go. All right. Here we go. Well, all right. 
well, at least uh, they, at least these aren't they aren't they aren't critical hits, but they do uh, some decent damage. Besides, aren't zombies like um, aren't undead immune to critical hits because they lack the vital points? Right. That's what I was saying. Yeah. yeah. Ah, I can learn blood okay. tentacles. What the f? <laughs> <laughs> okay, there we go, and that's the end of your turn, Ivan. Your go. Okay, so I'm a team player here. I want you guys to tell me what you think of this. Okay. So, um, I have something. I know that this isn't going to work on the zombies because again, they're not. They don't have a lot of brain function. But for Bracken, uh, I have a combo I can use Breaking. here called fascinate, and. Where is it? Um, suggest behavior. I can All actually right. make him help them to hold, help us hold them back. All right. Is he undead though, or does he have enough of a mind? Uh, yeah, that's a good question. What I would I good question. Knowledge? What I would more suggest is trying that on. You know, this uh, Stretch Armstrong over there. <laughs> stretch arms. Uh, yeah, his stretchy arms actually could like kind of protect us from stuff like that. Okay. Our, yeah, that, so okay. we can do that or music up. Okay, so you're gonna yeah. fascinate him and then try to suggest. Well that is that okay with everybody else? He wanted our take input. The party's advice here. Should we go suggestion or music up? Uh... Okay, let's <laughs> I wish. Honestly, I wanted to um, from Ivan's um question, I wanted to roll a knowledge arcana to see if break or whatever it is to see if breaking is undead or not. Uh that wouldn't be an arcana check. Would it be a religion or um nature? Uh that would actually have yeah, that would have to be some sort of detection spell. Ugh. I, wait, 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 wait. I, do I have something like that? Well, uh, Ivan, you need to save your spells for what you want to do. That is true. We know because well, fascination is a uh, is an ability, not a spell. Oh, okay. So you could cast two spells, but, or, or is it ability and then a spell? Or Josh, help me out here. I think it's two standard it, abilities and a spell, right? Uh, fascinate. Ooh. Then okay. So if you're trying to fa fascinate, then suggest. That's that's. In total, one standard action. Ah. Oh. Okay. No, that, that, that could be better. So what right. do you guys say? Uh, test it. Find out if he counts as an undead first. Yeah, test right, it out. Yep. Pretty sure I got a spell that can do that. So, let's see. Um... Analyze, was it Analyze Dwemer or Legend Dwemer. Lore that takes forever? Dwemer. Dwemer. Dwe Dwe uh, Legend Lore takes forever. Dwemer doesn't. Okay, so I could just use that then. Okay. Uh. All right, so you discern all spells and magical properties present in a number of creatures or objects. So everything within... Uh, 70 feet, looks like. Yeah. So, so yeah, you detect. A lot of magic in your little burst area. You detect um, no magic coming from breaking, ah. but you do detect a lot of necromancy coming from the goons. From the goons? Yes. yes, pretty much. Okay, so so, so he's not an undead. Yeah, so breaking has no necromancy magic affecting him, so I think this actually would will work on him. Right. That does actually ma that makes that ooh that sounds so good. Oh my gosh, I love this so much. All righty. <laughs> I'm having fun. All right, so that's my spell, and now I'm going to do my one standard action. I'm going to try to fascinate and then suggest to him, and maybe he can help us hold these guys back. Please okay. work, please work. Okay. So and it actually affects him for, I think, like a few days even. So. Okay, so, yeah, that's, I'm going to need to get a perform check from you. A perform check? Sure. Just give me one sec. And if that doesn't work, I can always play a song because I still have one standard action okay, left. Yes. So if that fails, I can always uh, play a yeah, song. Yeah, you better hope you get a good one because this perform check, it's going to be the DC for the save. Oh, boy. All right, perform check. Here we go. Ivan, the Big broken mod. bard. Come on. Wish me luck. Oh. oh. Eh, that's not good. Bad roll, good modifier. <laughs> yeah, I know. All right. All right. So remember when getting a when getting a twenty at all was considered an amazing roll? I know, yeah. right? Shush. Sheesh. Sheesh. Oh. Please be good. Okay, that was, was a one. A, ah, it was I, a what? That one. What? 
Yay! That one. Oh, I can't say that because that Tangled episode isn't out yet. Mm. Okay, that's fascinated. All right. So, yes, he is fascinated. And, yeah. All right. Nor does it allow a second saving throw. As suggestion. The suggestion must be worded in a manner such as to make the activity sound reasonable. So, wordsmith. All right, work your, work your magic. Literally. <laughs> no. Can't say that about Tangled either. This one, if, if this succeed, this succeed <sighs> is that he is basically sees me as a friend. So I basically have to word it in a way like to ask him a favor from a friend. Uh, it's interesting to see how you can word help the enemy in a way that seems reasonable. Please, please, my friend, all of these, everyone, everyone on this side of the bridge, they mean so much to me. I need you to hold back these zombies and these foes so that everyone around me can be safe. Won't you help me? Ooh. Wait, That's... isn't it charm person that makes them think you're a friend? Uh... It's influencing the act. It's just influencing the actions. So, yeah. Yeah. Now uh, needs to. But yeah, he already nat one to that. So, yeah. Yeah. It's like you strum your music and then your words assault Breakin's mind and he just kind of. He just kind of reels back. Ooh. And, he, and then he's, he begins almost ironically zombie like, moves over to the. Some of the dwarves and tries pulling them away. <laughs> okay, Thank we'll get you. Him. All right. So, Owen, your turn. Oh, wait, wait, don't I get another standard action? Uh, you cast your spell and then you did the, you did the set fascinate and suggestion. <laughs> Didn't you say that was one standard action? Though? Well, you also no, have that, like, analyze Dwemer. And then analyze Dwemer as a standard action. As well. Oh, okay. Never mind. Then I'm good. All right. Plan worked. I'm happy. All right. Next. Oh yeah, it worked great. Okay, Josh. All right, it's time. Oh, to gosh, right. there's that tone. Uh, okay. Yes. Hold for just a moment, please. All right. This is not what you think it is, not by a long shot. Oh, boy. Josh. Yep. I have been holding back for a very long time this session. You have dropped some serious hints. <laughs> and oh, my goodness. Have I? <laughs> I I don't know. It just sounds so perfect for Owen. All right, let's do it. So let's do it. I now have understood why Bracken would seek so much to serve Zalem, and why you made specific mention of falling off the bridge. You don't know where it ends up. You're not about to do what I think you're about to do. Yeah, and that's and how... why King Orkram specifically said, my son. Yeah. Uh, Push. But <laughs> it would be a fantastic story beat, I have to admit if that's the idea you're going for, because for goodness sake, if you really wanted someone to be a rival to Owen, oh, wow, that would be some impressive storytelling. Yes. Let's go. Doc, on. what are you doing? So. Oh, I just clicked. I'm scared. <laughs> Me too. Oh, I, I just, it sounds like you were dropping some major hints, and, and I was just holding things back for a long, long time here. Don't say anything. Don't do anything. <laughs> let everybody just do their... Just do it! You <laughs> built up the God! <laughs> you built here. enough tension, you don't need to build an outhouse of it! <laughs> let the, okay, come on, let him do this. It's like, we, we keep complaining about how he never speaks. Let him actually speak. <laughs> That's true, actually. Right. I just wow. wanted to say 
First off, bravo, Josh. That is a very, very good story beat. <laughs> now, that tells me that the key to this right now is to have the king and his son be able to understand that both are wanting the other to, I don't know. I mean, this would have been Zaylin living in the Underdark for, I don't know how many decades. <laughs> so Boy, yeah. I would have thought that if this wasn't a whole battle situation that I'd pull them both into the dreamscape right now. But I don't know if I can do that. I don't know if that's even allowed given the circumstances, goodness. But it seems like that's the one shot to end the battle quicker than anything else I can think of, like right now. Wait. So, Josh, DM, what am I allowed to do here? In order to show that the king and his son have been reunited. Better question, I think, and I'm not trying to over DM you, Josh, just wording his thing a better way. What is he allowed to try to do? Uh, just ask me what you got what you wanna do and I'll say yes or no. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Wait a second. I'm if sorry that I kind of... Zaylin's not! Right now. No! That would be awesome, but no! <laughs> I am not but he's a drow, right? Yep, mouth shut. No! To be fair, I'm, like, I'm gonna have to remake his me! Surprised. I hate surprises. Okay. <laughs> the idea was well, to get the both of them into the dreamscape but I don't know if that's possible in the middle of a battle sequence unless I can somehow finagle it through a time stop and then a dream sequence between the three of us. Is that possible? You're going to try and do a dream sequence during the middle of a battle. During the middle of a time stop. Time stop, pull them both into the dreamscape. This is some Xena nonsense right now. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm really reaching here because I don't know how else I can get the all three of them to reconcile, given that this is a very uh, distracting situation. Who are we reconciling? Uh, you would have to be able to get them to s fall asleep. Yeah. I know Lullaby, but I already used my turn. So. The higher the level, the less likely that sort of thing is to work. Yeah. And is Zaylin, does Zaylin even have the stature of a dwarf anyway? Yeah, yeah, that's what I was wondering for a long time. Because that's the only part of it that doesn't make sense. But Josh, my goodness, either I'm so way off kilter and you were unintentionally giving me something that worked into something brilliant, or this was your plan all along, and those hints were very intentional. Anyways. Mm -hmm. I suppose the first step is definitely a time stop. But I can't put them to sleep, not in the middle of all this. Uh, Just give them sure, up. maybe you don't want to maybe bring me in there too, and then I can play a song? Yeah, I mean, play all... Everybody would have to be asleep in that circumstance. I can't put him to sleep from this far away. Fair enough. It may have to be something that waits until round two and all of us working together somehow finagle. I don't know. Right. Okay. Right, well, you got four rounds. Let's see what you can do. Yep, let's figure something out. <clears throat> First, it's important that we make people last as long as they can. So, there are a number of things I need to do. What happened? Are you okay? I, I almost dropped my computer off the bed. Ooh! Are you okay? I'm fine. I caught it. Good catch. 
High reflex save. You rolled a good. Uh, you rolled a good reflex save. Dang nab it, you too. Okay. So, Cloak of Chaos, Mass Bear's Endurance. Woo! Prayer. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> You're excused. Okay, it's a prayer. That's not a prayer. Yes, it is. No, I, I was joking. Yeah. 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 The belch is no, is no prayer. <laughs> There's just something almost like cathartic about when Doc comes. <laughs> um, he comes right? up with a plan, or when he says a word, it's like the most impactful plan or impactful word ever. Need I remind you of the pebble? Uh, <laughs> no, first, no, you I was do not. Thinking, summon a giant boulder, roll it in front of me, get everybody to knock all the way off the bridge, but this seemed much more. Story centric. Yeah. But I'm gonna have to wait on that for now. Mm -hmm. Let me think. I pray, I pray right, you be our eyes and watch us where we go. No. Okay. <laughs> Lead us to a place. Divine power. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna have to do some uh, moving. And oh wait. Make my monster grow! <laughs> <laughs> well, this is this is divine power, oh, yeah. not righteous right. might. If I did righteous oh. might, it might push people off. I didn't want to do oh. that. I yeah. was remembering wrong, but I still think I nailed that voice. Yes, you yeah. did. Yes, you did. <laughs> okay. We also gain 18 temporary hit points. Uh, better. Yeah, I gotta add a lot now because, uh, so that's, uh, two. Okay, so. Uh, two times 18. Oh, I miss right. caffeine sometimes. Sorry. It's fine. It's fine. Sorry, sorry. He likes doing that. It's okay. All right. Shut up. <laughs> I got my water. Why did I miss? <laughs> okay, so let's it see. will never die. Nope. It's the best running joke. Mm -hmm. hey, don't, don't, don't push yourself. I ain't making a shirt for that I imagine one. that Amber's going to try to get into the thick of it, isn't she? Well, I thought about doing something, but then I saw what Zaylin can do, and I'm chickening out on that. So, <laughs> okay, okay, so yeah, that's four rounds. So that's that. One, two, three, four. You, you still got two more rounds of spells. Yeah. But I don't think Bear's Endurance can stack over Mass Bear's Endurance. Nope. So it doesn't make a difference to do that. Oh, that might be useful. Ooh, that's good. Oh, protection from evil. There we go. Oh, yes, please. Protection from evil. Because if I'm reading Owen correctly, I could brisk it, but first up, I don't even know if I have enough room to maneuver. And, um, again, it's Zaylin. It's evil Owen. I'm scared. <laughs> yes. So, yeah, you got a plus 12... What's up? What is that? You got a plus 10 to your strength modifier temporarily. Ooh. Yeah. Wow. Um, he's big. He oh, no, he's he's nah. extra strong. Extra Okay. okay. Extra thick. <laughs> no. Yes. With no. five C's. I don't quite get that. It's asking for input value on bless? What? Oh. That's supposed to be bless. That's supposed to be bless? Alright, yeah. well, we'll fix that. Okay. Why does this keep happening? I don't know. Okay. I don't know. It happens with, well, it's, it, I don't know. It, it's random spells at random times. Yeah. Depends. Okay. It's helpful for our allies, just in case anyone trips over the side. Let's see. 
don't want that. Caster and all allies in a and try and get a uh, plus. There we go. There Whoa! Whoa! Ooh. Look at that! Well, well then. Well, how about that? Isn't that? All right. So every. So yeah, everyone. Everybody. Uh... Yeah. Walk your body. You followed it. Thank you. <laughs> I did too. <laughs> Light oh, brings back. back. All, right. All right. Hey, Jake. All right. <laughs> okay, so that's uh, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's uh, those are all those spells. So oh, if the time back. stop all ending, right. that means I get to do one offensive action, which, according to what Zaylin did, is also a defensive action. Mm -hmm. Mass heal. Okay. All right. But that affects undead. It affects everything. Uh, I actually looked up the rules of mass heal. It's technically a burst spell. A burst spell. Yeah. So anything within that vicinity. Yeah. So everything, uh, every, all creatures within a thirty feet. Within thirty feet. Okay. That doesn't match what it says on the actual spell. I know, but it's, I know that, but I actually looked up like what the rules actually mean. It's like it's a it's a burst spell without actually being a burst spell. That's uh, interesting. That is interesting. Sorry, well, it's, it's no. Still hit, it's because I figured damage. that you were going to use it for this exact situation. I wanted to know, like, wait, how does this actually work? Okay, I mean, he's smack dab in the middle of the bridge. That's awesome. So basically, we get two hundred hitch points back, and they lose two hundred hit points. Yeah, well, that's for um, that's many, many different targets. That's the thing. Each. 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 Oh. Each. So they all all lose on 200 hit points. Yeah, so that is a very powerful spell. Dang! Me, oh, well, he is a tank for a reason. Me. That, that is a very powerful spell for this situation. Thank you, Owen. No. <laughs> I tried. They can't all be winners. Right. You should have a first winner before you say they can't all be winners. Excuse me, I'm holding a glass of my best joke right now. <laughs> okay, all right. I gotta give it up to Finn for that one. That was good. Speaking of which, I'm just, speaking of which, I'm just gonna quick grab a drink. I'll grab a drink after my turn. Well, remember you not one. She's next. She not one. I thought she and Valil were going last. Yeah. Uh. Oh yeah. That's uh. Yeah. I need to actually change that order. Oh. <laughs> I'll go get a drink then. <laughs> no, I'm very grumpy. I had an uh -huh. idea. Now I'm grumpy. I can't text. Sorry. Okay, so that means Soren goes next. And uh, in typical fashion, he fades away into the shadows. And he is going to he's going to try and come in from the back. Oh no. No, we anticipated that. Oh. All right. Also, I'm still invisible, so I mean. Yeah. Yes. Well, I, I feel like um uh, so. Soren's last in Mario Party. I'm invisible uh, at long three as turns I left, and exactly. uh, oh, whoever uh, Cam that and whoever Toad calls in is just miss. like, oh that yeah, it's Soren definitely. Soren will come from behind. Oh. <laughs> And people in the I don't know. I I've been playing. I've been, I played a lot of Mario Party right, recently. So, Sorry. Uh, he attempts to go after Nia, but Nora just jumps her sword in the way, and it's just like, nice try. No, I think that and, and that, she, that, she, that she that she kind of Sparta kicks him off the bridge. <gasps> yes! Oh. yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. See, what I thought she should have done is be like, hi, Sensei, kick. Oh, that was awesome! Okay, retconning. <laughs> <laughs> and then Nora, Nora looks over the edge, says, 
I don't think we've seen the last of him. You know, shadows, a lot of shadows down there. Okay. True. Hey, Josh. Yeah. How many of the un how many of the undead dwarves were completely knocked out or destroyed? I love Sorn. But gosh darn. Thank you, Dora. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so that was. Ooh, wow. Look oh, at that line. That. It's more beautiful than any tan line I've ever seen in my life. Holy! Holy! <laughs> oh, good. Yay, breathing room. Although, although these ones probably should still be here. These four. I don't know. Oh. Oh, yeah, because it's only up to this line. Ah. Alright, what I miss. Good thing you've got your wife being fair. Yep. Yeah, I'm... I know it's probably not as fun, but yeah. you know so, Ryan, that's you're still impressive. It still knocked out about a third of the undead army. Yeah. Oh, what I miss? What I miss? What I miss? Hey, um, Owen's, <laughs> oh, Owen's first um, made a lot of zombies go boom, and Nora kicked Soren off the bridge. She can't. Yep. Soren's gone. Ah, uh, well, well, well he's temporarily. In the shadow, so he's gonna come back, but that was still an epic move. Uh, okay, so all of basically. Um, all of, like, the main players in this have haste now. So they get plus one to AC, reflex and attack, uh, plus 30 foot speed, may attack twice, so it gives them an extra standard action. Uh, it, it gives them an extra standard attack action. So we all have three actions. Okay. Pretty much. Fantastic. Thank you. You're welcome. What can I say except... Okay. No, we don't. No. Uh, what no. can I say except... Josh, could you please okay. uh, scroll down to the... This giganto blankety blank part of the army. Yeah. Yeah, down here. Okay. Um... Black tentacles. Ooh, that's good. That, that... Is that rain? That, that range? Okay. Yes, it is. Just My range 290 is... feet. Mm-hmm. And then I want it to go, I want it to at least, yeah, like emanate right he, right, um, right in this center thing so that it can possibly hit Zaylin as well. All right. Let's see how that works. Oh, boy. Well, hey, Valil, that... remember these? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, unfortunately, Zaylin passes his save. However... You pretty much grabbed every single dwarf right here. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> All right, and then, um... Nice. Don't yeah. go off the bridge, but do something. I won't, but I was gonna... Ooh, what do I... Do? Okay. In order to buy us some time... Oh, this chair is killing me. Uh, I may need Wall to find a new one to do reactions in. Bending. Yes. Wall of stone, okay. And I'm gonna do it right here. Now, the stone wall whose area is up to 95 feet. So basically, I want it to be double wide. So it, basically there's a gigantic uh, 10 foot thick wall between this section of the army and us. Okay. All right, I, I wanna find a better. That wall is thick. Damn it! You beat me by one second. <laughs> this way, they have to Great either break like... through the wall, or you know, pull a thorn or whatever. Well, um, and this this way, the spellcasters and whatnot can you know buy us. Some oh, what was Zalen's last name again? Mm, go uh, whatever. I'll just use his first name, <laughs> Mister Zalen. Tear down that wall. <laughs> so basically, these. We don't have to worry about these guys right now because they're behind a wall and they're black tentacled. So and Brack, uh, Bracken is still on our side and Bracken. probably going to be for a yeah, while. And, so. and yes. Cruel's on the uh, on our side, so we can't, you know, we can't, you know, charge um, charge can't through. Retreat. Yeah. Whoa, hold up. Bracken and Cruel are on our side. No, Cruel's uh, Cruel's on our side of the wall. Bracken's Bracken being mind controlled. Side of the basically. Yes. So uh, basically, so, who's mind controlled? Breaking. Breaking. Big, big dwarf. This big, All right. This big guy. And Cruel is on our side. No, Cruel is not on our side. Cruel okay. is, oh, is in our vicinity. He is not Got under it. our control. He's on Thank our you. side of the wall. Thank you. 
This way we can take care. This, my thought was this way we can take care of two members of Venom at a time. I mean, hey, yeah. Godswall rules. You're over here now. You're one of us. And it, and it prevents, you know, Zaylin from, you know, mass hurting all of our dwarves and whatnot. Mm, pardon. So there we go. Okay. All right. Great. <sighs> and I didn't attack, so I'm still invisible. That was extremely clever. I was gonna Genius. Summon, I was gonna summon something until Zaylin did the thing with the elephant. And I'm like, well, there went my whole strategy. <laughs> what do you think, why, why do you think he tries? To, why, why do you think he try, He's trying to go after you because you're dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> well, now he's gonna have a. Whole lot, he's gonna have a whole lot harder time with that. You know, with a gigantic ten something foot thick wall. Yeah. And it has, um, and the wall four. actually has AC. <laughs> Are you kidding? No. Wow. Here, okay. hang on. A oh, wall of stone. <laughs> AC, um, AC stands for, ah, oh, crud. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. I'm keeping it forever. <laughs> <laughs> um, but the AC is like, oh, jeez. If do, 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 do. each panel has AC 15 and 30 hit points per inch of thi thickness. So, say that again, I'm sorry. AC 15 and 30 hit points per inch of thickness. So that is, oh, 10 feet by 12 inches. That is 100, that is, <laughs> that's a lot of hit points. And that's just I'll, one I'll panel. Calculate that. I'll calculate that in a sec. But so basically, Amber, it's your turn. I basically, I gave us a bit of a defense. All right, Amber, you're up. All so right. this is basically the best case of extra thick that I've ever seen in my life. Yep. <laughs> anyway. That's thick with, like, seven Cs. All right. <laughs> Amber, I was about to say freaking 20 Cs. Y'all have no idea how grumpy I am to be last. Yeah. <laughs> Take it out on the dwarves. Thank you, Ari. Take it on the zombies. Activate Golden Dragon Blessing! Woo! Okay, so how much is all that? Right. That's in a 60-foot radius. You're all good. Okay. Oh, oh. Yeah, Woo! buffs are very powerful right now. Yep. <laughs> We're all playing a role here. I turn my attention to Cruel. Uh... Okay, wait, was that an action, the, the, the magic thingy? Uh, free action. Free action? Oh, whoa, awesome! I fly towards Cruel, Scorpion Grass! Alright, well, you're <laughs> Alright. It's on! And she has, like, like, and she like, has a bunch right. of buffs on her from Owen and stuff like that. Oh, fight! Wow. Fight! Oh, fight! Right. <laughs> Which is what they've been doing the whole episode, but still! Alright, so, gonna, so, yeah, move up to him and attack, or? Yep, move up and attack. So fly over. Let him have it, count, honey. Does that count as a flank with the barrier right there? Uh, yes, technically. Yay! Well then, sweet. Hello, cruel. All right. So Hi, make your attack. Stretch. Remember me. Uh, one moment. You, uh, you touched my legs. Prepare to now. Prepare to see my thighs extra close. You okay, touched my legs. Oh my. Oh my. Skelly. I, Jay, I Are you just going to calculate the bonus damage? Or... Yeah. Okay. Full attack. Yes, please. Hello? Respond to me. Thank you. <gasps> uh, <what>? Holy! <laughs> not, one's a crit, but not, not a full crit, though. Aww. That's still good damage on Cruel. Okay, yeah. It's Scorpion Grasp, though, so... Alright, so, yeah, now Sweet, I'm definitely. going to need... Yeah, three definitely hit. I know. I know because uh, one of the, uh, I think I remember was it the the kick to the crotch one was like twenty nine or something. They roll grappled. I'm never gonna forget that. Uh, oh, and uh, it's like flanking with the barrier. Yep. Oh my goodness, the barrier is actually. I don't think they ever attacked. Oh, wait, no, oh, they, they did. They, they did. It's just they been did. a long round. Yes, it has. <laughs> yes, it has. Um, okay, so yeah, now I need to check something. Uh, Honey, does she need to roll grapple? Oh. Uh, I don't think yes. she does. Oh, wait. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, you got a free grapple after that. Okay. Woo. Now let's see his. 
He, he's a I barbarian, so he's that, a, he has a lot of strength. Right on the side. Oh. Wow. Oops. Uh, that is a two. Oh. <laughs> but, you know, bad rolls are bad rolls. <laughs> If you, look, if you look at a 20-sided die, that looks... It's like the 20 and the 2 are right next to each other. Yep. So Looking cool. at them both right now. Man, so, yeah, you have him grappled. And I got a 15. <laughs> and, he, and he's hurting, too, I think. Yep. So that is... All right. Mm-mm. Well, he's under control, guys. Have fun. Good job. Seven, two, six, minus that. All right, so, uh, your golden dragon pre- uh, um, so, uh, that, you need a second attack as well. You actually get a third. Oh, yeah. Whoa, okay, so oh, yeah. are they I, both- I used haste, honey. Yeah. Are they both full attacks then? Yeah. Oh, yeah. well then, give me a second because every time I use this thing, it's very slow. Yeah. I love haste. I'm so happy I picked it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Final Fantasy would like to have a word with you. Okay, mm-hmm. come on. Oh, whoa. Good, <laughs> except for the last one. Oh my gosh. What okay. The heck? Okay, one more. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hold on. Wait, did that work though? Lucky thing, there's no nothing for you to fumble. Yeah, yeah, fu- yeah fumble was weird. The I, I saw I saw a, a video of it. I think it was like DM Lair did a review. It was like uh, like how you would work fumble into your thing, but most <laughs> does people it mean like to drop something or? <sighs> it's like more. It's more like damage to yourself or like something involving. Uh, I, for, I forgot what the term was, but it's. It's basically like something, like something, some sort of action happens where like uh, you miss your target or you hit someone else on like on your on your own team. That that counts as a fumble. Okay, dude, this is like if he's not dead by now, I'm I'm a little I'm a little ruffled. I feel bad if I kill him. I, I don't I want him dead. Don't, don't, I would want him reformed. Yeah, don't so. try and kill the guy. Yeah. Oh, All right. Up to the so, uh, not dead. Okay. okay. I'm sure he's hurting. <laughs> if he all has right. a face left, I'll be surprised. No, it's like, yeah, he's just like all the clawing and beating and punching. Yeah, Cruel's, uh, Cruel's out hurt. having some issues. This hurt. is what you get for touching my leg! <laughs> this is what you get for messing around with your Yakuza! Yeah. <laughs> I got that reference. <laughs> okay, Lil's up. Oh. All right. Oh boy. So yeah, he doesn't. He seems to be. He walks up and oh, you can't see his expression. Never mind. No, I've got a wall. Yeah. I have a feeling though, with that knee up, I won't have right. a wall for long. So yeah, he starts play. He starts playing his flute, and I'm going to have to ask everyone to make. Uh, will saves. Oh boy, I, I know we'll this. Okay. I know what this is. Um, see. Can he target someone he can't see? With it music. With no, I mean, or, yeah, with you can hear the music. Yes. If it's checking. music, you could still hear it. So. All right, so yeah, it's... and he knows you're there, so. All right, just let uh, Josh, let me just let me know if I have to reroll. Yeah, it's not so good. <sighs> Golden Dragon Blessing gave us some saving throws too, so. Right. Yes, as the Cloak of Chaos. Right. That is true, He's so good. we actually have a chance. <laughs> That's as good as I would have liked. Yeah, we, we, ha- we have bonuses around in there, we'll, and Josh will add them. Yep, you have bonuses, and I'm going to have to roll spell resistance. <laughs> Alright. Who didn't roll? Um, uh, oh, what? Uh, Owen, did Doc you roll? Didn't. Doc? Doc? Owen, you gotta roll. I'll get to it. Okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's not bad. Uh, right. Same as me. Uh, 
Actually, All legit, right. the exact same as you. Oh my goodness. Yes, same as me. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so um. Yeah, Rose was like the only one with like a really so good the two will. People that failed their saves, uh, or didn't pass through spell resistance, are Jalarum and Owen. Oh, uh, what? Oh, Owen. oh, DM, can I re-roll then uh, with um, which is the thing? Yes. All right, re-roll. Uh, Owen and oh, much Amber? better. There we go. Okay, okay. you pass. <laughs> Wait, Owen didn't pass, but Amber did. Uh, it did. It's uh, you roll. You roll spell. Re Resistance specifically. Ah. Uh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, because uh, of, because of the cloak of chaos. Okay. Thank, thank you. Uh, and uh, Owen, yeah, so uh, roll a second time too. But Amber's roll was lower than Owen's. It's the spell resistance, not the will check. Okay. Yeah. She passed. All right. So, uh, so thank Owen you so is. Uh, Hearing a very familiar song. All right. Song of Despair. And yes. Come on. Be nice. All right. So I am going to have to hold two D6s. Yes. All right. So that is a four, and that is a four. You take one, four strength and four dex damage. Oof. Well, luckily he buffed himself really high with that strength. He had like a plus ten. Now he only has like an extra six. All right, so I'll bless you. Bless you. And then he, and then he's all, and then you hear another tune, almost as he's playing two at the same time. So, uh, uh, so a mashup. Everyone gotcha. Everyone is suddenly filled with an unbelievable sorrow and takes minus two to all of their attack rolls. Oh, oh no! Uh, everyone does. Yeah. Well, oh, I think I know what I can do on my next turn then. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Counter song music battle, yay! That, it is going to be Jiminya's turn. She's going to she's going to move up and strike. That's going to hurt that. Where do I mark that minus two? You don't. It's since it's a mass thing, we just keep track of it, right, Josh? Yep. Yep. Okay. All right. Yeah, I was about to say, where is everybody else on here? <laughs> yeah, it's uh, I'm having everyone else. It's like to prevent the it from getting too cluttered or too complicated. I'm having certain people attack at certain times. Okay. okay. All right. Okay, so this will this will be easier when we do mass battle. Well, the the final mass battle. Yeah. Okay. Spoiler. Uh, Spoiler! It, uh, after the three-page freaking diagram that I know, I'm having fun. Up. You <laughs> suck. <laughs> I know. All right, and here's here's something you might find fun. Verdoc. Oh. Huh. Uh, <laughs> oh. Zero creatures. Oh yeah, that shouldn't be zero. Oh. Oh. All right. So what happens is he turns around and he lifts some rubble from behind him, lifts it up in the air, and then thrusts it forward. And then all of a sudden, the, the rock breaks into tiny little things and starts shooting like bullets. I've seen that. I've seen that scene from um, Notre Dame, Hunchback of Notre Dame. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Uh, that, 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 that's that. That's that. Yep. Okay. I'm thinking like earthbending. Uh, all right. Uh, so that's uh. Okay. And she's gonna roll those. Uh, so the dwarves are kind of, you know, hold up, are kind of holding the line because they kind of realize that you're the most powerful ones here. Hey, uh, Josh, question. Yeah? That's that despairing spell that Valil cast. Does that count as evil? <laughs> Uh, why? Because well, you have I have protection braces, from people. Protection well, well from I think people. it was only on one target, though. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah, pre yeah, protection from evil was only on one target. Uh, okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wanted to make sure. That's all. Yeah. I got a plan. Don't worry. I'll fix it. Okay. Uh, I'm well, hang sorry. on. Well, hang on. 
Um, Owen's protection from evil, well, did he use it on himself? He used it on, no, he used it on Amber, right? Yeah. Doc? Yeah, he, he used heroism. Or... I used heroism. Or he used, he used heroism. Where is that? Right after Bull... Right after Bull's strength. And uh, protection right from evil, that's a touch spell. I believe he used it on himself. Yeah, oh, okay. that All would right. have to have been on himself. That makes sense. Ooh, there we go. Okay. So, no mind control? That No, I was just asking because I was wondering if there was some sort of save I should have rolled at that. Alright. Okay. Oh well. Anywho. So, anyways, um... Uh, Nyan and... I don't think Nyan and Gareth have done yet. Working on it. Alright. There's a lot of people here. There <laughs> are. <laughs> All right. So what's happening now is Nyon is casting Ice Storm. Ooh. Shit. Ooh. It's like summoning the shadows from from below the bridge. They coalesce into this weird. And they, they coalesce into this facsimile of a cloud, and then they shoot out, their like shadows that are. Almost like a blizzard. Where? Toward, uh, beyond the wall. Ah, so, okay. so here-ish, I assume. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And also, where did uh, Verdock aim his bullets? Same place. Cool. Ah, they just gotcha. Yeah. Okay, so that would be... Nine. Nine. Nine, whoops, not nine times seven, nine plus seven. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I, I mean, I would have been fine with nine times seven. Okay, so, and that's a 20 foot radius, so. Yeah, 400 actually. use the middle to the end of the wall if you're doing it. I think. Right. So that's a one. Uh, Okay, and actually, if you if you aim it like right here, I don't, okay. I don't know. It's uh so Nora and Gareth are actually staying in formation. You know, Nora's Nora's got got a defensive stance right here in case anyone tries to flank nigh on a rhyme. Okay, which we and, know that Sorn probably uh, might. Yeah, yeah. Gareth saw that happen, and he's moving over there as well. Gotcha. All right, good move. Good move, you two. Smart, smart, smart. All right, and next what happens? Okay, uh, I heard a staticky sound and I was worried for a second. No, but then I realized it was somebody's microphone. Okay. No, it was some it was my phone vibrating. Ah. That's okay. It's okay. All right. You hear a it's a you hear a lot more zombies than you do before than you heard before. Uh oh, crap, boy! Oh, yeah. joy! Yes, there is. <laughs> Fish not good. All right. So. All right, and a couple of them are going to attack you. At least the ones that are currently on the on this side of you, so that means... It's, I, I was not expecting a lot of this, but then again, I was expecting not to expect something, so it doesn't Don't count. <laughs> <saying that. laughs> Perfect for dungeon mastering. <laughs> and remember, the, the the big pack of zombies over here, they are grappled with the Well, the time for talking is over! Yep. It's time to push buttons. So they ain't moving nowhere. Nope, they ain't. Alright. And with that... Oh. Actually... Hey, um... Josh? Yep? Yeah? I think... I think the Black Tentacles stay. I don't, think, I don't think it's a single cast. I think every time new zombies move into the area of the Black Tentacles, they're affected by the Tentacles too. 
Yeah, that's it's my standing. Yeah. Me. Uh, oh, by the way, did you? So yeah, you have Yeah, she. So she made it. She made a double layered fortification. Cool. Yeah. Oh, by the way, I think you moved Zaylin uh, off the stage. Whoops. My bad. Yeah, I was wondering what the heck he. All right. Oh, my... he, uh, he was floating. To quote Raven from Teen Titans in the episode How Long Is Forever, nobody hurts my friends. <laughs> uh, all right. Nice. That was a good episode. All right. One of the so... best things. That means that y'all take this much. How much? Ow. Wait, where'd Zaylin go? Oh no, he was off the bridge for like a second. He's still off the bridge for me. Well, that's that's oh. your. That might be on your. That might be your computer end. There we Play. go. Now it's Breakin's turn. He's going to make another save against uh. Ivan's fascinate. Could you uh, d could you roll another perform check for me? You got it. Please stay alive. Please stay around. Please stay around. Okay, better. Ooh, right. That's even better. All right. So that was a. Where are you? Seventeen. Plus... He's right behind Faye. That's a. 30. No. Not enough. It's okay. like breaking. Yes. I wonder if Breakin could possibly bring what? Zaylin over here. That would be helpful. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's got to get over that wall. I'm sorry. That sounds so evil, Doc. <laughs> how tall? Wall. Okay, now I'm curious. How tall is my wall? Stone wall. I thought it was. Did it say like ten? It's ten feet thick. <laughs> oh, never mind. Yeah, not ten feet high. Although right. I think it's it's pretty high. All right. Uh, Ruby. Also... Yeah. And I was right. It was all combat episode, but it, it was an entertaining one. So yay. <laughs>